We continue to work through this pandemic. State leaders are really focusing on getting testing sites up and running. One of those screening events happening today in Pulaski County, our Alexis Wainwright is at Arkansas Baptist College with a look at the efforts to reach communities that are being hit hardest by this virus. Alexis. This past week, we saw a record high for COVID-19 cases across the state. And as we work and try to flatten that curve, state leaders are now hoping to focus more on HBCUs and minority communities. A disproportionate number of individuals have been affected. And the only way you know if you're affected is if you're tested. State Senator Linda Chesterfield and others pushing for testing sites at places in minority communities. Saturday, they partnered with the Department of Health and UAMS to host a testing site at Arkansas Baptist. It's imperative that they be tested so that they know and we know that it is safe for them to open schools. This event is just the first of three for HBCUs, historically black colleges and universities. Anyone can get tested whether they have symptoms or not. Meanwhile, Dr. Neldia Dykus offers some advice for everyone moving forward. Wear your masks. Keep a social distance. Keep your hands clean, wash your hands, treat others as if you're infected. Dr. Dykus' words align with Governor Asa Hutchinson Friday. He urged Arkansans to follow public health guidelines this weekend. He said 900 cases is too high and we need to reduce that to make progress. If you don't have to go out, Stay home. More than 130 people came out to get tested. Chesterfield says it's important for everyone to know their status so they can know how to protect themselves and their loved ones. I'm so proud to see members of the African American community, the white community, Hispanic community coming out today to say it matters to us. The next event will be at Philander Smith College on August 8th from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. For more information on their events, you can log on to our website. Reporting in Little Rock, Alexis Wainwright, back to you.